Hey everybody, it's Polish Pete, and guess what? Berkeley has come through. The trucks are showing up here now, and we are getting tons and tons of new products loaded up into the racking. We're, there's so much that we're gonna have to break this up into a whole bunch of different videos because there's literally hundreds of new families and additions that we're adding to our warehouse here. I'm gonna go over these six right now because there's six that we were getting a lot of ass for. I know some of you saw that because you'd signed up for our notifications on those flatworms, they showed up and they gone. They went real fast, so hopefully another truck shows up full of flatworms and we'll get those out to you soon. But in the meantime, check out these new additions for us from Berkeley as well. Some of them are new, some of them are staples that we're just now getting our hands on. Starting off with the hollow belly swimmer. This is obviously one of the families of soft plastic swim baits that is very popular and has its time and place where it outshines everything else. Uh, the hollow belly swimmers have a lot of action to them, a lot of thump. So if you're looking to cover water and find more aggressive fish, it's almost like fishing a spinner bait or a bigger, you know, like a crankbait, that kind of uh, reaction bite trying to get that with this. This is not a finesse swim bait. This thing's got some power to it and it's looking for a big bite. Um, next up is the grass pigs. We got all the sizes in grass pigs and all the different colors. I chose this one because this is their new HD finishes. So it actually has a real lifelike minnow finish to it and several different forage bases. So great swim jig trailers. And I got another tip for you. This is also, uh, these little ones are killer little spinnerbait trailers as well. They don't get a insane amount of action behind them. Just a nice subtle little kick to the boot tail there. So it doesn't screw it up if you want to fish that more subtle style trailer uh, on a back of a chatterbait or a swim or a swim jig or a spinnerbait. Next up is the Champ Swimmer. So these are new to me. I've read about them, seen them. I've seen that guys that are multi-species anglers are starting to throw this thing a lot. It's super soft in hand. This one here, once again, is a HD finish. They do have it in your traditional colors like green pumpkin and white and black blue, all that stuff too. But this is an HD finish. This one's sexy shad here. It looks incredible. Feels way better in hand than I imagined it. it does have a split belly. Lots of different options and ways to rig this thing. Uh, looking forward to seeing where this thing fits in in my arsenal because it is kind of a different swim bait. Uh, you're gonna have to trust me on it. Once you pick it up, you'll see what I'm talking about. It's definitely an interesting one. I bet you this one finds a home in a lot of anglers' tackle boxes. Next, the Champ Minnow. So this one here is a little drop shot minnow, Jordan Lee bait. It's kind of got a shad profile body to it, but it's got uh, you know a traditional uh, vertical tail on it. Uh, so this thing's gonna be interesting. It's a, definitely a different style drop shot minnow where most of them either have a little boot tail or straight tails on them, something like that. It's giving them a little bit of a different look, more realistic kind of look to your profile on a minnow presentation. I think this thing's gonna be a little killer too on a jig head bouncing along the bottom as well. Uh, there's probably a bunch of different ways you're gonna find to rig these things. They're real realistic looking and they're made of power bait, so they're gonna get bit. Champ Craw. Now this thing's super realistic looking. Uh, I think it's, you know, intention, judging by the body size and the, and the shape of it, is gonna be a little flipping bait. So Texas rigged this thing with a weight and a punching and some matted vegetation, things like that. Real realistic finishes, like I said. So if you're looking to match the hatch and get really realistic on them, this is a great option for a jig trailer or for a punching bait or a flipping bait. So check out the Champ Craw. And last, and certainly not least, we have the power, the flat nose jerk shad. So this one here is a Maxent product. So Berkeley's Maxent products are really intensely scented. Uh, as you guys know, the insane amount of popularity around the flat nose minnow, the flat nose worm, all those baits, uh, Berkeley General and the Maxent. So this is a jerk shad. This is one of my favorite ways to fish and more of my, I should say, more one of my confidence way to fish. If you just rig this with a EWG style hook, like a four rot in this thing, and you just fish it weedless and like a jerk bait, and this thing's weighted great. You can tell this thing's gonna sink really well. This would be a killer uh, option for you to get those tougher bites, and or if you wanna fish a jerk bait style presentation around any sort of vegetation or hard objects or you're worried about treble hooks getting stuck in things. So check out this one here and stay tuned for tons more content revolving around Berkeley Soft Plastics and their hard baits. We're getting a whole bunch from here, like I said. Uh, so a lot of them are loaded up on the site now. So if you can't wait for new, more videos to come out, just go some digging around on the site. And as always, give us some feedback too. Let us know if there's something we're missing. In the meantime, go catch them.